Hello, and welcome back to another amazing episode of Jetline Marvel. We will compare two military cargo aircraft in this video. The Airbus C295 and the Embraer C390 Millennium are both medium-sized military and civilian transport aircraft, but they have some differences in terms of their capabilities and features. The Airbus C295 is a military transport aircraft designed for a variety of roles including airlift, cargo transport, and air ambulance missions. It is produced by Airbus, a European aerospace company. Advanced navigation and avionics capabilities, including a head-up display and a digital map, are included with the C295's purchase. Strong demand, there is a lot of interest in the C-295 among military and governmental organizations all around the world. Production on a worldwide scale. The C-295 is manufactured in Spain and has a global supply chain, utilizing parts obtained from all over the world. The Brazilian, Portuguese, Hungarian, and Royal Netherlands Air Forces are already using this aircraft, which has had several solid orders since its inception. It recently reached a new milestone. This aircraft is utilized for more than simply troop transport, it is also employed for mid-air defense aircraft refueling, and is successfully undergoing firefighting tests. In terms of multiple role aeroplanes, this one is the master. Let's compare the Airbus C-295 and the Embraer C-390 Millennium's capabilities and features. Size. The C-390 is slightly larger than the C-295, with a length of 33.9 meters, 111 feet, and a wingspan of 31.9 meters, 104.5 feet. The C-295 is slightly smaller, with a length of 27.87 meters, 91.3 feet, and a wingspan of 27.6 meters, 90.7 feet. Capacity. The C390 has a higher passenger capacity, with seating for up to 80 passengers in a typical configuration. The C295 can seat up to 71 passengers. Range. The C390 has a longer range, with a maximum range of 3,400 nautical miles, 6,300 kilometers. The C295 has a range of 2,000 nautical miles, 3,700 kilometers. As a military transport aircraft, the C295 is being developed through international partnerships. It was primarily designed by Casa Spain in collaboration with Airbus Indonesia Aerospace and Tata India. Since 1997, the company has produced about 200 aircraft, which are currently serving in the Egyptian, Polish, Royal Canadian, and Spanish Air Forces. On the other hand, Brazil is the country that developed the Embraer KC390. Additionally, Embraer is well-renowned for its commercial aircraft and has further enhanced these models with cutting-edge technology. Although it has experienced difficulties in the international market for orders, the company is able to obtain new business as it gradually gains confidence in the defense sector. Embraer has currently produced eight aircraft and is searching for new customers. Speed. The C390 has a higher maximum speed, with a cruising speed of 450 knots, 833 kilometers per hour. The C295 has a cruising speed of 365 knots, 675 kilometers per hour. Payload. The C390 has a higher payload capacity, with the ability to carry up to 23 tons of cargo. The C-295 can carry up to 9.2 tons of cargo. Power Plant 
The C390 is powered by two General Electric CT7-8 E engines, while the C295 is powered by two Pratt & Whitney Canada PW127G engines. Avionics. The C390 is equipped with a modern glass cockpit featuring advanced avionics and navigation systems, while the C295 has a more traditional cockpit layout features heads-up display and other avionics. Service ceiling. The C390 has a higher service ceiling, with the ability to fly at altitudes up to 41,000 feet 12, meters. The C295 has a service ceiling of 35,000 feet 10, meters. According to the most recent price list, an Embraer KC390 aircraft would cost approximately $100 million, and an Airbus C295 aircraft will cost approximately $54.3 million, as per the Indian recent defense contract agreement. Both airplanes are utilized for multi-domain work, and each has its unique characteristic specification. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe if you are a new viewer of our channel.